No way. これケットコさん。こうやってこの足がですね。No way. There's no way he can do that. There's no way that this is real. Whoa, look at that. These guys are flying all over the place. I guess I'm gonna go and try and find out if this is really gonna happen or not. Watching a video clip on Aikido only strengthened his doubts. He decided to dispatch his students on an intelligence gathering mission. Though they've been practicing martial arts for many years, neither of them had any experience with Aikido. One is a black belt in karate. The other is a professional mixed martial artist. The only limitation placed on their expedition is avoid injury. Other than that, anything goes. They too harbor suspicions that Aikido isn't all it appears to be. A man with 25 years of Aikido experience may dispel their doubts. First test, a conventional attack. A collar grab and an attempted push. But the 80 kilogram adversary is pinned in two seconds. Next, the professional martial artist takes the offensive. He was about to deliver a kick while protecting himself with punches, but the Aikido expert quickly read his move and avoided the leg. In a flash, he sent the adversary flying. Maybe two against one will fare better. Or maybe not. The Aikido man captures the martial artist who launched a punching attack. Then he used that man's body to shield himself against a simultaneous attack. One by one, the challengers are defeated. In fact, they tried several times, but still ended up on the losing end. こっちがこう出てくときとかそういうところに本当瞬間的に合わせられるっていうか技をかけられたときとか崩されててバランスが取れてないんで何されるんだろうっていうのは一瞬思っちゃって自分が何されてるか分かんないんですけどハッと気づいたらもうなんか動けなくなってしかも腕が痛いし硬いものを相手にしてるっていうよりもう何にもないものを相手にしてるような感じというか。戦っている感じではないんですね。戦うというわけじゃないんですけど、なんか自分が組み伏せられていると。The head of Yoshinkan is Yasuhisa Shioda. He is the son of the legendary Aikido master Gozo Shioda. We asked him if he would distill the elements of Aikido for us into its essence. 先生、hello。あ、どうも。My name is Nicholas Pettis. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, sensei, maybe you could tell me the uh, ultimate meaning of the word Aikido. Um, Aikido is all about concentration and timing. It's all about how well you handle those two elements. My father and master, Morihei Ueshiba, used to say that Aikido is a match in a flash. For instance, when you're fighting with a sword, you never know whether your opponent will wield it straight or some other way, but when he does, that's the instant when the result is decided. In order to know the opponent's next move, you have to read his mind. For example, in baseball, you don't know the speed or the impact when you hit a home run. It's intuition, right? That's why players practice to enhance concentration and timing in their swing, for instance. But it's done in a flash. 
Aikido is also done in a flash. And that's why enhancing concentration and timing is so very important. In older times, a samurai might have to face ten enemies outside his home. Some would be armed with daggers, others with swords. In that situation, he couldn't afford to let his concentration lapse even a little bit. In modern times, that samurai spirit is flagging, unfortunately. Winning just for the sake of winning has pushed the spirit off to the side. It's just a survival of the fittest mentality now. Once or maybe twice in a lifetime, we're faced with a real life-or-death situation. Dealing with those moments with spirit is what Budo, or Japanese martial arts, is all about. So, Kancho, um, through the program that I've been able to do this time, I was uh, very, very fortunate to learn a lot of techniques and experience of many things. And I understand that Aikido was uh, a, a form based on protecting oneself through uh, uh, the way of the, uh, the samurai warriors used to fight. And they always had swords and, and big sticks. And Well, I've got this little thing here. And uh, if it's not uh, an inconvenience to do, maybe I would like to try and attack you a little bit and then see what happens, if it's okay. Yeah. Be my guest. <laughs> Come and get me. Hi. How was that? <laughs> what just happened there? <laughs> wow, that was fast. Uh, I thought I was the one attacking him, but uh, as you can see, I'm the one who ended up on the floor. And this had no effect whatsoever. I'm just going to chuck that away. Kancho, um, I just have one more thing I'd like to try. During all this uh, time uh, experiencing Aikido, I have not seen one kick yet. Oh. And towards the kicks, um, I would like to see if you got some kind of special defense that maybe oh. I could use for myself. Would it be okay to try one kick against you? Okay. Yeah? Yes. Nicholas's kick is strong enough to break three wooden bats. No question, it packs power and speed. And that's Aikido for you. Ooh. Thank you very much. It was a very learning experience for me. Thank you.